Now, President William Ruto's newly unveiled cabinet hit the first roadblock yesterday after the National Gender and Equity Commission, NGEC, raised concerns that the list did not meet the two-third gender requirement as well as it does not have any representation of persons with disabilities. In a statement sent to newsrooms, NGEC regretted that the current nominations consist of 15 males representing 71.43%, which brings the total men to 17 when the president and deputy president are included, and only six females representing 28.57% candidates. NGC chairperson Joyce Mutinda told President William Bruto, who is the appointing authority, to ensure that the final cabinet list fully complies with the Article 27, 54, and 55 of the Constitution of Kenya 2010. President William Ruto is yet to name the next cabinet secretary for East African Community, Arid and Semi-Arid Lands and Regional Development and the Attorney General. After Rebecca Miano, who had been named as the Attorney General, was moved to the tourism docket. She said this in a quote, the rigorous process will ensure that all appointed individuals embody the principle of equity, non-discrimination and ethical leadership Leadership. End of quote. This is a um, Cuban